On December 17, 1903, in Kitty Hawk, North Carolina, Orville and Wilbur Wright made four brief flights in their first powered aircraft, which they called the Flyer. Thanks to that achievement, they soared into history as the inventors of the first successful airplane, earning the honor of being first in flight. But do they truly deserve this title? The answer is a bit more complicated than you might think. In fact, a number of inventors in the United States and Europe had launched crafts into flight before the Wrights in 1903. If others flew before them, why do the Wright brothers get all the credit for inventing the airplane? The answer depends on how you define the word airplane. To truly be an airplane, experts say, a flying craft must be heavier than air and it must be manned and powered. It must also be able to take off and land under its own power. Finally, an airplane must be controllable along all three axes, known to pilots as roll, pitch, and yaw, in order to avoid crashing. This last feature marks the key contribution of the Wright brothers. Through their innovative wing warping design, they gave pilots three-axis controls, helping avoid the crashes that were so common among early aircrafts. Another reason for the Wright's unique place in history is that, unlike some other early inventors, they continued to work on and improve their designs. Some say Gustav Whitehead may have beaten the Wrights to the punch by making a powered flight in 1901 in Bridgeport, Connecticut. Whether this claim is true is still being debated, but what seems clear is that none of the flying machines Whitehead built after that date ever got off the ground. By contrast, the Wrights had continued success with their designs, and by 1908 they had developed a practical craft that would carry two people on longer flights. Through public demonstrations and teaching their skills to would-be flyers, the brothers enabled aviation to spread around the world. Even today, more than a century later, planes and pilots continue to use the same basic skills and control system developed by the famous brothers. So even though the Wright brothers weren't the first to leave the ground, they do deserve credit for making a controlled, sustained powered flight in a craft that can rightfully be considered the world's first successful airplane.